the story goes that a teenage Enrique Iglesias was so determined to make his own way in the music business without cashing in on his father's fame, he borrowed money to make a demo tape and shopped it around under the name of Enrique Martinez. After scoring a deal with an indie label, he released his first album under his own name at the age of 20. Five singles from the self-titled album ended up topping the Latin charts in 1995, and he won a Grammy Award for Best Latin Pop Performance. Three albums later, thanks to the crossover success of Ricky Martin, he was ready to release his first English album, Enrique, which featured duets with Whitney Houston and Bruce Springsteen. It debuted at number 10 on the Billboard charts, and his next album, Escape, did even better, debuting at number one on the Billboard charts and spawning the mega hits Hero and Escape. His romance with tennis super babe Anna Kornikova also buoyed his popularity, and he followed up Escape with a 50-date sold-out tour of 16 countries. With the release of his 2003 album Seven and more raunchy videos, he solidified his image as a smouldering Latin lover, and Enrique made no apologies. There, there's always a danger with, with exposing yourself too much, uh, uh, sex-wise, when it comes onto your music. But one goes with the other. I mean, music and sex go together, and, and people think about sex, it's, it's, it's normal. It's not like it's illogical. It's, 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 it's in our heads, it's in our minds, and, 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 and it's, I think it's okay to express it musically. You know, we, we shouldn't be afraid of, of doing that. And he explained why so many of his songs revolved around love. I focus my music on anything that's going on in my life. And a lot of times it talks, of course, about love, but I do think it's the only thing that uh, really uh, we all have in common, whether you're, you know, you're black or white, no matter what age you are, no matter what religion, what nationality, we can all relate to that. Despite his obsession with love, however, three years later, at the age of 28, he was no nearer tying the knot with Anna. But he was still showing plenty of commitment to the career that has delivered 19 Spanish-language singles to the top of the Latin charts and shifted over 90 million albums worldwide. What drives me is truly the, the, the love for what I do, the love for music, and, and, and um, I, I love my job. Uh, it, it, yeah, it's not a point in my career where it's about money or it's about... Obviously, we all like to be successful and, and, and do well. Um, but it truly is about how, how strongly I believe and, and what I do.